What water filter system do you use when you're out camping, hiking, backpacking? Tell me down in the uh, comments below. What we're going to do today is we're going to talk about the Epic water system. So the Epic out of Boulder, Colorado, that, this filter came out in 2015. And what they did is they came up with a filter because their goal was to reduce plastic. And it's really nice. I've been using this for two weeks. It takes care of parasites, viruses, which you really don't have to be too worried about in the outdoors. Uh, Cryptosporidium, giardia, uh, cysts, heavy metals, chlorine, the whole bit. Um, so it's really, and made in the USA. And I've had really no problems with it. There's been some concerns with the fact that, well, water's going to seep through the straw, right? Uh, show you here. I have not seen that and I've been really paying close attention to it. Um, when you change this out, you clearly do it like this, if you can see. And the this is rated for about 500 or more uses or three to four months. If you're doing a lot of hiking, I would suggest you err on the side of three months. You don't want to get some waterborne illness. Now this is a 32 ounce uh, Nalgene water bottle, which are very durable, they're awesome. Uh, the filter, which is here, is gonna run you about $30. The bottle, the Nalgene water bottle alone, is like 42. Survive Outdoors, we have, and you know I like stainless steel, down in the description we have a link to our merch and this water bottle, stainless steel, single wall, not double wall, is 22 bucks. It comes with this, but the um, filter and the lid you can get fits perfectly on our system, on our little water bottle. So, and that's really nice. So, shameless promotion, there it is. All right, so, the uh, Epic water filter, it has been approved by the National Science Foundation and the American, I gotta read it again, the American National Standards uh, Committee. Now, the American National Standards, they have the NSF, the National Science Foundation, do independent studies. And so this has really been cleared by both. Um, uh, we have tested, and I'm going to put that video at the end, we've tested the Catadyne Be Free, which I like, the Grail water compression system, and the Sawyer, and the Life Straw. So we've tested all those systems out, and I'm here to tell you, I really like this uh, filtration system. It works great. Let me address what we, I know, I know I've beat this to death in other videos, but I'm going to drive it home again. So when I do presentations for Boy Scout groups and even adults, I always discuss the fact that if you're lost, should you drink the water or not? And I always get, you know, a show of hands on both sides of the coin. If it's three days or more and you are have no water and you run across a creek, a stream, a lake, a puddle, drink the water. The incubation period for Giardia is about three weeks. You'll be found. And you'll be alive, and then what we'll do is we will treat you. So in those situations, drink the water. Take a uh, filtration system, the Epic, Sawyer, Catadyne, whatever, and use that. It works fantastic. I really do. I really like this uh, Epic filtration system. It works fantastic. If you have any questions, throw them down below. Otherwise, keep your eyes on the rise and your face to the wind, and we will see you next time, guys.